Lopping Hall in Loughton for WrestleForce. We've got a singles match coming up. Two big lads, two veterans of the ring, the Dark Wolf Matt Walters, James Farrell, the WrestleForce favorite, gonna lock it up in one-on-one -on -one action. James Farrell getting this audience behind him straight away. Center of the ring, these two jockeying for the position. The crowd under Matt Walter's skin. He's smiling, but he's clearly annoyed. I don't think that Dark Wolf Charlie's going to get off the floor, Matt. The crowd firmly behind James Farrell. Russell Force favorite, former champion, holding three belts at once. Pharrell happy to let Walters sink or swim in that moment, and he definitely sunk with the WrestleForce crowd. Here we go, Colin Elbow tie up in the center of the ring. Pharrell gets control of that arm, wrist lock, great technique, pushes the neck and chin against the wrist, roll up, this one could be over quickly. Walters shocked by what happened, manages to get out at 2.9, but it was that close, and James Pharrell let him know. Walters does not want to try tie up with Pharrell in the middle of the ring. There is one thing that he cannot match Pharrell on. It is that technical grappling in the center of the ring. Walters should go for a striking game. Use a bit of power and try not to tie up with Pharrell. Connor and Elbow Tarp in the middle again. Pharrell gets advantage. Snapmare into another cover. Pulls him over. This time Walters smart enough to know it's coming. Rolls straight through but retreats to the bottom rope. Pharrell letting this crowd know what he thinks of Waters and they're, they're all happy to oblige. Waters comes in low, fakes out for that Conor and Elbow Tarp and just kicks him in the gut, back club, kick to the chest. This is what Waters needs to do, strike and strike fast. Double X handle to the back. Pharrell looking a bit, a bit shaken by this quick flurry of strikes by Walters. Tight, tight head on there. Control the head, you control the body. It's an old cliche for a reason. Pharrell, separation, sends Walters across. Shoulder tackle by Walters. The Dark Wolf controlling this match early. Pharrell follows him in, jumps over. Drop kick right on the money, right on the chin. Pharrell showing exactly what he's made of, showing why the WrestleForce fans love him. They're calling for the finish already. Pharrell looking like he's happy to apply. Got a hit. The Olympic slam. Waters though, sees it coming and slides out, goes under the bottom rope. Had enough already. The fans letting Waters know that he is a chicken. Waters asking a member of the audience to check his tooth there. Pharrell trying to invite Walters back in the ring. Walters finally making his way back. Taking his time though. Trying to regroup. Good, good idea by Walters. Take Pharrell out of his game. Start the count again by breaking the plane of the ropes. Give yourself another 10 seconds. Pharrell's had enough though. Gonna follow Walters around the ring. Runs after him, Walters runs, gets back in the ring, lures in Pharrell, kicks him straight in the ribs. Now just working the neck, that boot to the chin. Got to the count of five to let go, let's go just in time. Walters not giving the referee an easy time in this match. Really making referee Kyle work for his money. Pharrell sent to the outside. Waters, just a double overhead shot. Those bear chops to the back of Pharrell. Look for another shot. 
Blocked by Ferrari, the European uppercut. And another one. Three times. And Walters goes for the eye rake. Slowing that momentum down instantly. Taking the low road. Chest shot by Walters. Hurt his hand, he chopped him so hard. Grabbing Pharrell by the hair. Telling the camera to get out of the way. Throwing Pharrell into that corner post. That corner post is square. It's not rounded off. It has corners. And Pharrell's forehead just came right off of one of them. This could be over. The referee checking on Pharrell. Pharrell clearly saying he's good to go, but is he? Pharrell looking dizzy as Waters heads to the top rope. Waters now coming off the top. Shotgun drop kick. Turns Pharrell inside out. Great cover. Deep Pharrell barely, barely getting that left shoulder off the ground. Just making sure by showing that right one is coming off after. But Pharrell, this one doesn't feel like he's got much longer left in it. Pharrell looks beat. Referee Kyle telling Waters he will be disqualified if he keeps this up. Brings Pharrell to the centre of the ring. Snapmare. BK. Pharrell is done. This one's over. I shouldn't count out the heart of James Pharrell. He is a triple champion in the past for a reason. Waters with that rear chin lock. Got assisted quite deep around the groin artery. Pharrell looking like he's struggling to get some oxygen in him. Slowly collapsing. Waters asking referee Kyle to check with James Pharrell. See if he quits. Cinched in deep in the middle of the ring. Pharrell trying to fire himself up. Trying to fire up the WrestleForce faithful. But struggling here. Finally gets his face back underneath him. The hips underneath. Swings Wilder with that elbow to the gut. Causing that separation finally. Momentum off the ropes. Walter sees it coming and hits it with a clothesline. What a clothesline. Up his feet into the cover. Pharrell kicks out. Pharrell breathing deeply now. The crowd have had the win taken out of them by this blistering offense by Waters. Got to give Waters all the credit in the world. He may have taken the low road, but he has grounded James Pharrell. Pharrell not looking like he's got anything left in the tank. Off of the top turnbuckle, face first, sets Pharrell across the ring. Pharrell floats over though, bit of offense, there it is, European uppercut, and a second. Gets that second rope, calling for it, punching the head of Matt Walters, the, the fans counting along. We hit the 10 count. Sends Walters across the ring. All that power using the turnbuckle as a tag team partner. Big back body drop by Pharrell. Pharrell realizing where he's in the ring. Got to get that cover. Give himself a chance to win this match. He has found a way back in. He has found a way back into this competition. Have a fighting chance of putting Walters down. Evening the playing field. Can he come back though? Stumbles. That shows you the wear and tear of Pharrell. Up kick as Pharrell went for another back body drop. Waters saw it coming. Mishinoku driver. What a move by Waters into the cover. James Pharrell getting that right shoulder up. Just kicking out. The crowd trying to pump up James Pharrell. All that momentum he built has been stopped by that Mishinoku driver from the dark wall. Dark wall saying it's over. He's going to head to the top. What is he lining up for here? Arguing with the referee. Pharrell though, takes too long. Give Pharrell that body. Sends Waters across the ring. We're back to square one. Both of these competitors on the map. Pharrell first to his feet. Does that mean he's got the advantage? Gets up, followed by Waters. Hammer to the chest, that double sledge. Third one's the charm. Kick to the gut. Lines him up. Scissor kick. That has won Pharrell many matches. Taking his time to get to the cover though. Hooks the leg. 
Great weight distribution across the shoulders, but Walters kicks out. We have seen that in some matches before, but not this time. Great grit and determination by Matt Walters. Pharrell can't believe that was only a two. Asking referee Club, was it really not a three? Pharrell gets to his feet. Waters looking wobbly. Lines him up. Discus Lariat avoided by Walters. Double underhook. Face buster off the knee. Enza Guri. Pharrell doubled over into the cover. This could be over. Pharrell in a world of hurt. Really trying. Walters claiming that could have been a three. No one in the crowd believes it, but the referee confirms it. But here we are. Walters back in control. Saying he's going to finish James Pharrell. And at this moment, it could just be a matter of time before Pharrell is done. Loads him up with the Death Valley driver. Walters finisher. But Pharrell fights. Elbow strikes to the jaw. Sends Walters off the ropes. Looks for a clothesline. Swings on the and misses. Another flying clothesline. I think they may have both got each other with flying clotheslines there. We are in the center of the ring. Both of these big lads down on the floor. James Farrell trying to get some feeling back in his arm. Waters just trying to pump himself up. Farrell sliding across the ring. Maybe looking for the ropes to stabilize. No, he's getting up, getting the, getting the knees underneath him. Waters up first though. Allowing him to strike first with a straight right to the jaw. Pharrell, European uppercut. Just an open handed strike to the face. Pharrell, closed fist. Chest chop. These two show all the strikes they've learned. European uppercut by Pharrell. But he's going to keep going now. Following through. Keep striking. Keep hitting. Pharrell loads him up. Look for it. Look for the angle. Uh, Olympic slam again. Raking the eyes by Walters. Waters powers him up. Death Valley driver. This one is over. Waters into the cover. Pulls the leg, but does not get the three. Put no weight across the chest of Pharrell. He hooked the leg, but if he'd have sat out, sat across the chest, maybe Pharrell wouldn't have been able to kick out of that. Pharrell, though, looking like he's got nothing left. Both arms have gone limp. Pharrell's face is in the map. Walters pumping himself up. Gonna line up one more time. Is he looking for that Death Valley driver again? Pharrell slowly to make his way to his feet. Walters decided he's gonna give him a hand. Surprise! Discus Lariat playing possum the entire time. Pharrell baits in Walters. That Discus Lariat. What a strike. Waters doesn't know where he is. This time Pharrell gets him. Loads him up. Olympic slam in the center of the ring. Into the cover. This one is over. Your winner, James Pharrell.